You know, I'm lying. I didn't take your fucking government vaccines. It's not for me. I'm not like you, sheeple. No way, man. I didn't get your government. I didn't get your Apple Pfizer. You heard me. Oh, yeah, I'm being disrespectful. I didn't get your, your Astra Martin. That one needs work. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't get your... Uh, I didn't get your funky cold Moderna. Oh, that's the good one. Through the three, bro. That one. I had to go that on the flight over. I'm sorry, Eurostar. <laughs> funky cold Moderna. No way, man. I got my vaccines off the dark web. Because at least I know what I'm getting there. And what I'm getting is a serum made by a guy called Ilyich in Moldova. Who also sells me Bitcoin and guns. I may have accidentally carried out a hit for me one time. <laughs> you know the joke was good until I added that extra bit. I was enjoying it so much. I'm just going to keep piling stuff on while they're being all nice and whatnot. <laughs> I'm nowhere near as good as I was before the lockdown, because uh, uh, that's another part of my rider. I don't gig anywhere without some sort of ventilation system. It keeps me in touch with my working class roots. I touch that and I look and I go, oh, that's who I am. Yeah, that's, a, that's a good system, but I'm not sure they put that in right. Yeah, that's, that's not going to hold. Not, not in that, that well. Oh, God, I'm fulfilled. And I'm <laughs> okay, we're all gonna get sick, aren't we? But, uh, it's like the Edinburgh Fringe. Thousands of you with uh, 58 years of getting people sick in England. <laughs> Bring them up, chuck them in a send them back down. Send them back down. Titra da da. Won't do that one. <laughs> Fuck, I'll do it, you know. Uh, oh, let's check the notes, sir. <laughs> Don't improvise too much. <laughs> you forget where you are. Yeah, yeah, that's a good one. Because there's nowhere to put it down low, but I didn't want you guys looking. I didn't want you guys looking at my notes, stealing my, my ideas. <laughs> my ideas lately, I don't know. Man, oh, I've been thinking about ghosts a lot lately. I thought there was fly ghosts in our flat, but it turns out it's just fluff. <laughs> You'll notice when the quality drops off throughout the show, that's me dropping in a new idea. <laughs> I thought my cat was a ghost for three years. Until <laughs> he jumped across me to get some food. And I thought, oh no, he's human. <laughs> Panda bear ghosts, of course, are photo negatives. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, you're probably thinking he's gonna he's gonna go back and work on that one at the hotel today. <laughs> no, I don't think so. I, I like how some of them just fall off a cliff. I like I like people think I think I like this guy. I'm not sure I like him anymore. <laughs> so dangerous, tight top hat. Oh my god, those lockdowns. Look at me, I'm just, I'm still carrying my lockdown weight, you guys. I'm still carrying my lockdown weight. It's a nightmare, this lockdown weight. Which is actually the same weight as before the lockdown. <laughs> but now it's got a name. It's my lockdown weight. 11 years! This lockdown weight, I can't shake it. My lockdown, my lockdown weight. But you know, I didn't let the lockdowns get me down. No way, man. I mean, I was bitter at first. I was very bitter at first. Like, I was very, very, I was very, very bitter at first. Because the first lesson I learned from the very first lockdowns was that this, whatever this is, is a job, is not essential. <laughs> learned that one right away. By the way, if there's anyone who works for the British NHS or the equivalent of the French healthcare services, I want you to know that uh, I went outside and applauded you every Thursday night, twice, <laughs> through gritted teeth. <laughs> Way to go, you guys! You must be very busy! At a job! Ah! Then I got this 
one friend, like an idiot, what a moron is this character? He works at the NHS, I don't know, he does some sort of help with folks live. And he's got like a, you know, showing off, what a wanker, and he's got, in his closet, inside his flat, with the doors all closed, he leaves his NHS jumper in there. I'm like, anybody could come along and take that and wear it around for a month or so. So I did that. <laughs> Just jump around Islington, just fucking. Uh, you're welcome! <laughs> just doing what I can. I love medicine, what can I tell you? That's nice, fixing people up. Love you, take care. Anna's wearing the top hat. 